always a nice day when I get some new and interesting tech sent to me. And today is one of those thanks to Enreal who sent me their new augmented reality glasses, Enreal Air. I got a couple of boxes. Let's first check out this one in the middle. And inside is a t-shirt. Really cool design on it. The material soft and feels premium. So thanks to them for this. The Enreal AR glasses are in this box and let's open those up. Nice, we get a case with this. Some documentation here, a cleaning cloth, a complete and detailed manual. Wow, this is pretty small and light. I also like how it's hard shelled. Here are the AR glasses. Really, really light. Not any heavier than a normal pair of sunglasses. Visually, they look pretty pleasant as well. Then right on the bottom here of the box, we have some extra accessories. There's two extra nose pads of different sizes, prescription lens frames for those that wear glasses, a light shield that will help if you're trying to use these during the day outside. Back to the case, there's also some additional storage that contains this small tool for changing the nose pads. And here is a USB-C cable for connecting the glasses to all your devices. On the actual glasses, there are some controls. Here is the on off button. These buttons here adjust the brightness. There's also a long list of sensors built into these glasses, including a proximity sensor. So the screen it pretty much turns off when you're not wearing them. They also have accelerometer, a gyroscope, and an ambient light sensor. Up on the screen, I have a fairly long list of the technical specs. Note the micro OLED screen. There's two times 1080p full displays, 60 Hertz refresh rate. There are built-in speakers and up to a 201 inch big screen experience in some cases. I also got this Enreal adapter and in the box is essentially just an adapter and a quick reference card. Now you don't even need this adapter when connecting to a Steam Deck or your Android phone. You do need it however in some cases if you want to connect the glasses to your PS5, your Nintendo Switch, your Xbox, pretty much anything that has a HDMI output. This does have a built-in battery that actually powers the glasses because it will need the power in those cases. This part right here is removable and that's actually really important for Apple devices as I'll show a bit later. Let's talk about the comfort and wearability. In short, these are really comfortable. They're lightweight, only 79 grams. There's lots of adjustment to fit your eyes. You can adjust the side hinges here. You can add some prescription lenses if needed. You can even swap out the nose pads for a perfect fit. These glasses are like a big screen IMAX experience in your pocket. Excellent for entertainment on the go. Connecting your phone is really simple. Just plug it directly using the provided USB-C cable. The glasses will power themselves from your phone battery. So you never really need to charge anything or carry around anything extra. Let's first check out YouTube AR. YouTube does have this augmented reality option and it's currently in beta. It's pretty much this gigantic waterfall design and with these glasses you can see this amazing view you get. With that app, the phone now actually functions as your remote. It's like a laser pointer. You can point at stuff and click. It'll act as a touchpad with a lot of different functions on it. It's really difficult to share the experience when it comes to AR glasses or virtual reality headsets. You have to really try them to understand. But I hope you get the idea with this captured footage. The built-in speakers on the back right here are sort of working like personal headphones. These glasses also work with the Nebula for Mac users. I mean, you're really mirroring your phone screen with minimal latency. So you can pretty much use all kinds of apps on this. Anything that's on your phone can be used here. These do also work with Apple devices and for that, you use the Enreal adapter. This little piece right here comes off and instead I can install an official Apple Lightning to digital AV adapter there. And here it is working with my iPhone. Just plug and play without any issues. Now let's get to the fun part, gaming. I'm gonna start with the Steam Deck. 
For that, you can connect it directly using the USB-C cable. You don't even need the AR adapter. I mean, with this, you're essentially playing PC games on the go on a really big 130 inch screen. And it's still all portable, pretty amazing. I also highly recommend this for mobile or especially cloud gaming. On an Android phone, all you need to do is just plug it in directly. So it's a simple connection. Just carry around the glasses. You already have your phone on you. Maybe carry your extra Xbox controller with you. With that small setup, you can game on the big screen, cloud gaming anywhere you want. Pretty awesome. For Nintendo Switch, you can also connect that. And for that, you do need to use the dock. So it's more of like a living room experience. Now there is a way to get around that. I'm actually using this uh, USB-C to HDMI cable to be able to play this on the go as well. Either way, you do have to use the Nreal adapter and plug in the HDMI output right here. Press the power button on the Nreal adapter to turn it on because that will power the glasses. And that's pretty much it. It's plug and play, simple as that. Playing the latest Nintendo games on this gigantic personal screen is really really cool the next gen consoles the PlayStation 5 the Xbox Series X both of those consoles connect exactly the same way as the switch use the Nreal adapter and plug the HDMI output to right here and it's really simple you got a full HD experience up to 60 Hertz gaming on the go with these glasses I gotta say I'm impressed really at how well and easy this thing is to set up and use how comfortable these glasses are and how amazing gaming on a personal air screen is so you might be thinking these are probably really expensive actually they're reasonably priced not much more than a budget monitor or tv the Nreal Air glasses are $379 US. The Nreal adapter is $59 US. And that is something you want to purchase if you want to use the glasses with your gaming consoles like your PS5, Xbox, or Nintendo Switch. If you want to pick these up, I have links in the description below. So check them out. For the rest of the video, check out some gameplay. I'm trying my best here to show you the experience, but honestly, you gotta try them for yourself to really understand how it feels. 